Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel. So for today's video, I thought I would do a nursery tour. We are like 99% done in Amelie's room. So I thought it would be nice to show you guys um, her finished nursery. Um, I'm gonna insert a clip here first of like when we first started painting it and like a little update along the way and then like towards the end of the video with the actual nursery tour. But I hope you guys enjoy it and please don't forget to like and subscribe and I'll see you soon. So this is the before of Amelie's bedroom. Then we just stripped the wallpaper. This there was black and white, blue and white wallpaper there. Where's that? We just stripped it. Tall. Rosie. Hi everyone. So I thought I would just do a quick little room update. Um, the last time I filmed, we were trying to paint the wall. Um, it took us a long time. Let's just say that. Um, we did. We started it and then. We kind of just left it and left the edges, but we finally done it. Um, so this is what it looks like at the minute. Yeah, so here it is at the minute. We've um, we've just painted the wall. Um, I, I only wanted to paint one wall, so um, the wall's done. The crib's there, it was Rosie's old crib, um, and that's literally as far as we've got. <laughs> but I'm gonna put my idea is over here in the corner I'm gonna put like a, a canopy so it's not going actually over the crib so it can't like it's not dangerous or anything but it's just like at the edge and it can maybe go over like just the end bit um, and then in the middle I think I'm gonna put three pictures I've got three I've already ordered three pictures from Decenio I just need to get frames for them and put them up and then over here I think I'm just gonna put like a floating wall shelf um, and then I bought like this like kind of like bunting type thing so I'm gonna put that there and I might find like a big stuffed animal to go in that corner I haven't decided yet so yeah that's what I'm gonna do there um on this side of the room I mean these excuse the ladder these shelves were already up when we um, moved in so I'm just gonna leave them there we've already got books up there for her I really like that and we've got a rocking chair um this was also one of Rosie's that was handed down to us from a friend um obviously we, we our bedroom's downstairs so we're gonna have to come up in the middle of the night to feed her so that'll be really handy um so yeah that's gonna stay there so that's pretty much done minus all the rubbish and then all we need to do here is this is a changing table we got for rosie that we never used so i'm gonna get rid of it i'm gonna give it away give it to charity give it to friend not sure yet um, i'm just gonna get a big chest of drawers and then i'm just gonna put like a picture or two up on the wall put a lamp up make it look kind of pretty up there and then yeah thankfully it's quite a small room so we don't have too too much to do but yeah so i will update you when i next have an update okay so as you come into the door we've got her name on the door and um, this is actually this was actually a gift from ash's mum um there's one on rosie's door as well i don't know where she got them from but i'll try and find out and leave um, a link below if if i can and then we've got some bookshelves these were left here by the previous owners, but I really liked them. They're just, I think they're just super simple Ikea ones. And there are all her little books on there. And then over here, we've got a rocking chair. We do normally have like a little um, like blanket just covering it, but um, that's in the wash. So here it is in its, in its prime. Um, we just sit here like if we get up in the night to feed Emily, we just sit in the chair or if we're reading the story before bed. And um, that was a hand-me-down from one of my friends when we first moved over to Texas. Here we've got her curtains, they've just got like, I thought they were pink, but they're like more of a purple colour, um, just like little tassels, but they do look really cute. So there's those, and they're from Target. And then we've got this little, I don't know what you'd call this, uh, a net thing, that's what I call it, net thing. And that was again from Target, and I just thought it had a nice little touch to the room. Whenever she sleeps in there, I push it back so it's not over the crib, but then normally for decoration, I have it hanging over. And then we've got the crib. Um, this was also a hand-me-down from my friend when we first moved to Texas. That was from Pottery Barn. I think it was a little while ago because when it, it was when her baby was a baby, when her daughter was a baby. Um, so I don't know if it's still available, but Pottery Barn's expensive, so it was probably quite expensive. And then if we go closer, this sheet was from Target. It's just got like cute little pink stars on it. This was a gift from someone. A blanket <laughs> and then we've got one of my favorite parts of the room are these three prints all the prints are from decenio i love decenio like i could literally spend like 
I could just buy all of them. I could spend a fortune on there. Um, I don't know how much they were. I will try and find out and leave them linked below. Um, and these frames were like $5 from Ikea. I was trying to find white frames everywhere that weren't ridiculously expensive. Um, and I managed to find these. And they look all right. The pictures are on the wall a little bit wonky because I did them. But for now, they look fine. But um, I'll see if I can link the frames below. Over here, I'm going to put this shelf up. <laughs> um, just I haven't got round to it yet because we don't actually have a drill, which is fabulous. Um, but you see like the little bit that's where you can hang clothes on. So just ignore that. That's the 99% of <laughs> what I was talking about. That 1% is not done yet. And then I've just got like a little storage bin here, which is from Target. And it's just got all her teddies in it. And this is her wardrobe. And the star says, born in 2018. That was a Christmas present from Asha's sister. Um, and then obviously we've got her wardrobe. It's a bit of a mess. Like, so I just piled on all her clothes because I'm so sick of every month having to clear it out. So I thought, you know what? I'm just going to do one big clear out and have them all hanging up. So it goes up to like 12 to 18 months. Uh, storage, which we need to sort through at some point. <laughs> do you know, just a wardrobe. And then over here, we've got um, this print that says Amelie and her date of birth. Um, I will try and leave it linked below. It was from a, it was from Etsy, so I'll try and find the seller. And the frame I think was just from Amazon um, because I thought I'd ordered enough of the white frames from IKEA and I didn't. So I'll try and leave that linked below as well. I love this garland so much. I want to get one for Rosie's room as well, but it's just so nice. I think it just adds just a little something to it. Again, I can't remember who this is from, uh, but I will try and find them and leave them linked below. And then, so the chest of drawers is a little bit of a fail because Asha said, you know, order it from Amazon, just keep it cheap. And I didn't realize it would be quite so small, but for now it's absolutely fine. It's just got like, it's just easy and it's just good to have a set of drawers. Um, we've got this nice little lamp um, and that again is from Target. Most things in my house are from Target. <laughs> I, th I feel like I'm a walking, talking advert for Target, but um, it's really good because it's got two settings. You can like click it on, and the bottom bit comes on, and then you click it on again, and the actual light comes on. So you can uh, you can have either or, or have them together. And then we've got this cute little special keepsakes box. Again, this was a gift I think from Asha's sister again at Christmas, and I love that. I think it's so cute. Um, and it's got like her little hat in it. Let's have a look. Her little hat from when she was first born. Her little tag in it from the hospital. Uh, and, and this is randomly from a hearing test, but I thought it was cute because it says I'm a girl. <laughs> so there's that. And then we've got this cute little bunny. We bought this. I think this is the one. Yeah, this one's from my first years and it's got her name on it. We bought this for her before she was born. And what I was going to do was take a cute Instagram picture with the teddy, but that didn't happen. But yeah, this just lives here because I love it. And then this I picked up from the dollar spot in Target, which I think was like $3 or something like that. Must have taken the tag off. But yeah, it's just a little money box. I just thought it looked cute. But I'm going to put this on the shelf whenever we get a chance to get it up. So, yeah, that is Amelie's room. Hopefully soon we put up the shelf. But, yeah, I hope you've enjoyed this video, guys, and I'll see you soon.